There are a lot of good news for trees and forests at the CITES Conference of the Parties. The Mukula tree is gaining better protection through regulation by being included in the Appendix 2 of the CITES Convention. And also the Mulanje cedar, Malawi's national tree, has been included in Appendix 2. In addition, the genus of neotropical citrella species has been included in Appendix 2. This is a very important timber in international trade. Further, Madagascar has agreed that the ban on its precious rosewoods and ebonies needs to be enforced and that all its stockpiles need to be accounted for and secured. All of these decisions are very significant and will help fight forest crime and stop international timber mafias. But the decisions are only as good as their implementation. It will now be of utmost importance that governments implement and enforce national and international laws on the ground. It's also very important that consumer and destination countries are implementing the CITES regulation by refusing this illegal timber that is still coming into their markets. Only if laws are enforced can communities and forests be protected for the long-term future.